Okay, so it's day 13 of Vlogmas, and today is just not my day. Like, I wanted to have, like, a cute little video for you today. I was going to do, like, a drive with me, going to go try, like, Starbucks drinks and shit, and then the day was just not good. Like, so just know, this video, this Vlogmas day, I'm still giving you Vlogmas, but, um, like, look, here, Christmas lights were festive, it's Vlogmas. Um, I'm still giving you Vlogmas, but... Um, it's a, it's a pointless video. It's just me talking about my day and like how I've been feeling lately. So like, I don't know, lately I've been feeling, ugh, and I hate talking like this because I feel like I'm just further manifesting it and like speaking it into existence. And like, that's the thing that sucks about being spiritual, um, and believing in manifestation is like, you kind of leave no room for feeling like shit because then when you feel like shit, you kind of hate yourself because you're like, wow i'm manifesting more bad things happening you know what i mean like if you're thinking of something other than abundance and positivity and happiness like suddenly you're the reason why your life sucks because you're speaking into existence it's like this like endless spiral and cycle of just trying to be the most positive person ever and acting like if you you slip up like everything's just gonna go to shit and it's your fault this thing keeps sliding because I, I guess I'm too heavy for it. I don't know. Um, yeah, so like, this is what's been happening lately. Like, um, I haven't been feeling 100% in myself and I feel like I'm constantly doubting myself and um, I feel like I'm like a little indecisive on where my mind is at. And I feel like one day I feel so sure about something and the next day I fucking hate it. One day I want this, the next day I want the complete opposite. I feel like my mind is just so inconsistent and doesn't know what it wants with like everything. It's so weird. Like sometimes I'm like, oh my God, all I want in life is to just be happy and be full of love and abundance and do all the things I love. And then the next second it's like, I just want to make a lot of money. And those things like kind of like, yes, they go together, but they also don't. Like you can't just seek love and happiness and abundance and in the same way just seek money it's kind of one or the other like yes you can have both things but there's obviously something that's more important to you and like my mind lately is like i want this and i love this and this makes me happy but like also money you know what i mean and um that's what kind of like drives a wedge between me and my channels it's like i love ashley flores tv and that's all i want to do like that's what i want to do and i know it'll create abundance but then the amateur guru is like the money maker but am i passionate about astrology like that anymore no i'm not so anyways like today and most days i'm more on the page of i want happiness and love like that's what i want and i feel like i just want to be more sure of myself and i want to trust myself more and i want to say something and mean it and not bounce back and forth between fucking everything and i'm just tired of that so that's where my mind's at anyways today today's been shit oh i'm getting a phone call one second i'll explain in a sec hello Hi. So I'm, I'm standing in front of the lobby. Oh, okay. I'll just be like two minutes. I just gotta grab my coat and stuff and come down, okay? All right, man. All right, thank you. Right. I'll be five minutes. I'm stalling. So anyway, so um, yeah, my fucking tire. I've been having issues with my car and like obviously this time of year is a little harder on everybody because of um, the holiday season. On top of that covid and it's just been kind of tough with me in that way um i'm still grateful i'm still able to live the life that i want to live but obviously i'm not as comfy as i once was along with that it's like my other channel i haven't been posting on it because like i'm just not that passionate about it so the less i post on that channel the less money i make and but that also means the more time i have for this channel which i fucking love so anyways like shit just keeps hitting me different like bills and different things out of nowhere and it's just like what's happening like i'm praying and asking for abundance and all this stuff and like i just feel like the universe isn't giving to me giving it to me and i don't want to feel like oh what was me because i'm still able to pay everything i need to pay i'm still able to live the life that i want to live like i'm okay there are so many people that have it worse i'm okay but obviously like you know this time of year like things are different so um I'm being real honest with you guys right now. This is crazy. So yeah, so there's that. And then like this week I had to go get my freaking winter tires put on. 
and suddenly there's an extra like $200 added to my bill because one of the lug nuts did this and I have to replace the lug nut and the bolt and the guy has to charge me labor fees because the fucking maintenance guy has to go in and do all this. Anyway, it was $200 more than I thought it was going to be and I was irritated and I just got my tires on. I get to my car today to go visit my family and like, what do you fucking know? My tires flat. How is my tire flat when I just got my tires changed a couple days ago? My tires completely flat. So I'm like, now what? So I'm trying to call CAA to come fix it because I can't even drive to the gas station and um, I can't even call them because my arm, I have like broken, not broken, I've torn tendons in my arm. Um, because of these torn tendons, I can't lift the stuff in my trunk that's covering the access to my spare tire. So my spare tire is chilling at the bottom of the trunk covered by so many different things. And I can't even fix that because my arm's like pretty much broken. So I'm now waiting on my boyfriend to come take care of that. But the CAA guy got here before my boyfriend and the CAA guy's not gonna do the fucking trunk lifting shit. And so now I, I was hoping, I anyways, my boyfriend's here. That fell. That's wonderful. Um, my boyfriend's gonna get here any minute now, but um, CAA guy's downstairs and I have to go take care of this. So this is like what I've been dealing with all day and I just wanted to go see my family and I couldn't do that. And I've just been in here just kind of like upset because all these other things are happening in my life right now that are just testing my patience. And I'm just really trying to keep it together and stay positive. And in turn, I just get frustrated with myself for feeling like I'm the one that's attracting negativity because I get worked up over little things sometimes and I don't know like this is just like me being open with you guys like people don't always have their shit together that's obvious that's very you know we know this um but like yeah like I don't know if I seem happy and like like I'm living perfection or anything on the internet I hope I don't seem that way because I'm really not um so if you ever thought that according to my instagram feed or my youtube channel is like i'm not like i have a very regular 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 schmegular life and shit goes wrong sometimes and it gets to me and i'm trying to read more books right now to get through that and like cope with things easier because i take things really hard and i don't know why it's like it's really frustrating but anyways um he called how many minutes ago how, how long have i 5 12 Ooh, it's been five minutes i gotta go i gotta go take care of the caa situation but that's why there's no real vlogmas video today i hope you appreciated me opening up to you guys i'm sorry the content's boring today but at least i didn't miss a day right right okay um i'm gonna go deal with this i'm gonna go deal with this bye <laughs>